clarinet. But I'm also going to be playing clarinet in the unusual way, it's like a nigh Arabic flute. Um, and even using some other extended techniques that I was inventing yesterday in the clarinet, like. That'll be fun, I'm just clarinet. And then didgeridoo, my didge, what I was just playing a second ago. And then I'll be playing my bag of goodies over here. I've got the tin whistle, I'm playing a little bit of Celtic. And then, who knows, I might bust out the slide whistle, we'll see. Um, the Chetamella, that's my double reeded instrument. That i got to wet my reed, but it makes a crazy sound like that. i got to wet it up. But, um, and then I might pull out my claves, possibly. And then my electronic wind instrument is at home right now. Yeah, I didn't bring my electronic. But um, that's a whole other field of instruments, and in a way, because we can have so many different sounds just using our one instrument. Well, I'm going to play a lot of different types of drums. I have two of them here. And I'll probably, I'll have several more there, and then the balaphone. Um, and then also um, an electronic instrument. We're going to do an electronic thing. It's, it's called a hand sonic. I didn't bring that up here. I, I have it in my car, actually. But it's, uh, it's like an electronic drum. You play with your fingers. But you, get, you can program a lot of different sounds, different types of electronic sounds. Like if I want it to sound like an Indian tabla, I can do that. If I want it to sound like a saxophone or whatever. <laughs> but mainly we use just electronic types of sounds on it rather than trying to duplicate um, acoustic instruments. So different types of drums, balaphone, and the hand sonic, the electronic instrument. And that's mainly what I'll be playing.